if you haven't received any offers for medicine, then this is the video for you. Hey guys, it's the Med Study, and we'll be going through what some of the options are. In particular, we'll be talking through UCAS clearing for 2022 for medicine. What is it and how does it work? UCAS clearing helps students to apply for places at universities where the amount of places have not yet been filled. This means that you don't need an offer in order to go through clearing. You can also consider it if you'd like to change your course. Clearing will be available on A-level results day, so the 18th of August 2022. Usually after the results have been announced, some universities still have vacancies. So how can you go through clearing? Before we move on to the actual process, here is some advice on how to maximise your chances. As per UCAS advice, it's best if you're up early and ready with your UCAS account, personal ID, grades, previous results and clearing number, along with some paper and pen. Get help. Ask your family and friends to also search universities with you. This will allow you to make multiple calls at a time. If you didn't receive the results you wanted, be prepared to explain any extenuating circumstances and evidence of these if possible. In terms of the process itself, firstly, you will be able to search for A100, which is the course ID for medicine. You need to make sure to search using the code because searching for medicine can come up with various other courses including medicine in its name, like for example biomedicine etc. Next, once you've found a vacancy, you should then call the university to ask them if they're able to accept you. You will provide some details and answer some questions and if the university agrees to provide you with an offer, then you can add a clearing choice on your UCAS page. Some questions to ask the university at this point includes accommodation options, like do they have any accommodation on campus, etc. and what the further process involves. It's important to remember that you can only add one clearing option at a time, so please make sure to contact universities that you would like to go to. Although any university could potentially have space for clearing, there have been some universities which have commonly offered places during clearing. Some of the universities include University of Buckingham, Hull York University, University of Central Lancaster, Anglia Ruskin University and St George's University. This is not a complete list but includes some of the options. It's also worth contacting the universities that you've already applied to to see if they are hoping to provide any more spaces. After contacting, if it's unsuccessful, continue considering other options because you may find another university. Of course, there's still a chance that you can study medicine through clearing, but it can be incredibly difficult to find a place due to the competition ratios. So if things don't go to plan, don't lose hope. There are some other options to consider. Firstly, you can consider reapplying again next year. By taking a gap year, it allows you to boost your application and identify any areas to improve for next time. There is also an option to study another undergraduate degree and then apply to medicine after graduating. This could be your fifth choice. Remember that medicine can also be studied anywhere in the world, so a different option could be studying abroad. Finally, it might also be worth considering other allied healthcare professional courses. A huge number of these careers share characteristics with medicine. Hope that helps and good luck. This is just a disclaimer that I am not affiliated to UCAS or any other university application team. So please do check all of the resources mentioned in this video and check with the official staff. And that brings us to the end of this video. Hope you guys found it useful. Please remember to like, share and subscribe and follow me on Instagram at The Med Studio.